Hello guys and welcome back to Star Sector. When we, I last left you guys, we were gonna kill this fleet here. And we we're gonna head up to Epsilon Ergatis here and do one of the bounties that involves this dual conquest and doom fleet. But for a moment, let's kill these guys. Oh, they're running away. Fine, fine, fine. Let's not kill these guys then. Plus, they're a uh, ludic path, and uh, we want access. I thought they were scavengers, but I still want access to their uh, planet here, their base here for supplies and uh, people and crew. And so that involves me actually staying in good, um, in good. Uh, well, not exactly good. I have 100% reputation with them. Minus 100% reputation with them, but uh, stay in. <coughs> sorry, but stay in. Um, uh, friendly terms with that base, uh, so I don't harass anything around it. So he's not here. It's probably at the other ready world. Oh wait, never mind. I just dropped uh, further away than I thought I did. the lack of significant uh, carriers I'm not gonna deploy my pirate falcons in this because uh, they're mostly anti-fighter and there is no need here but I will need to deploy some other ships though. Let's deploy the monitor. And actually let's deploy the dominator, why not? That gets me up to the maximum deployment rate and gives me an extra bit of firepower. Let's spread the fleet out using two assault orders on the sensor jammers. And actually in full retrospect I should have uh, given um, efficiency overhaul to the ships I'm not really using right now until I deploy, uh, put them back in storage in my Asura, just so I use less supplies per day.
bit of support here, actually. hit from the from my fighters. Oh, what the hell are you doing there? I think I know exactly what you are doing there. Um, this pilot that I have, it was previously in my <sighs> Sunder, which died often. And I put him in this, I was hoping he would be less stupid, but apparently that's not gonna happen. So I think I may just lose this Falcon because of that pilot. I may have to stop actually using him. Reckless pilots apparently are way too fucking reckless. I mean, this is a bad matchup no matter what you take. Let's try forcing those guys to give some support and that retreat. sure that this uh, shade isn't gonna help it much. the sunder as well. Oh, this is not okay. Sunder was unpiloted and that means I most likely lost it. Man, I hate fish ships.
So, minus two, minus a cruiser, minus one destroyer, and I still haven't even begun to attack their uh, conquests, let alone their doom. This is not really going for me, is it? And yeah, the Dominator is probably uh, getting hammered right now by the um, Doom. Oh my god. Save that falcon, but uh, no, this really didn't go my way. I lost the battle group falcon and I lost the center. Oh, and only the two hammerheads got to retreat. Okay, that's fine. Should I re-engage? Yeah, totes. Okay. Ship recovery. Thank God I can recover these. Although, honestly, should I be upgrading to Eagles at this point for the cruisers?
Oh wow. Yeah, sadly no, not a full conquest. I'm still looking for one with uh, damage systems, internal systems, because that will allow me to um, deploy it with lower uh, costs. Okay then, so... Arid world in a binary star system. Do I have anything close to check? Arid world, okay. There is one in this system. And actually I have a stable location so I can put uh, down the com relay. I haven't been here, so I don't know. And did these have any Arids planets? Gas giant, Arids, yeah, they had. Okay, let's just head here, head to this. See if it's there. Yeah, if she's not there, not a problem. I'm gonna uh, set up the um, comm network anyway and see what else we can find. Although, to be honest, Kind of really, I should be getting back the core worlds right now. That little top up with the supplies did me well uh, in the Ludic uh, path base, but uh, I will probably need um, a bit more supplies than they can handle. But again, I'm still surprised uh, I'm having so little problems with fuel. not uh, this planet here. Uh, habitable world. Uh, I had one of these, I forgot to explore it. It was probably uh, the exact planet that the base was on, which I don't think I surveyed. Did I? No, I didn't. Right, bounties. And there's still this to find if I want. This guy is new, which is in where? Giant primary star in the pieces. Comp Constellation, which is probably this one. Yeah, it's probably this one. Uh, let's uh, actually head back down to the Ludi Pack base, also get the data for the habitable world. I'm not gonna bother with. Uh... Or actually, yeah, let's head here. So I can at least have them open, because apparently a lot of bounties spawn in this uh, uh, nebula. Uh, so I, I can explore these, at least know what what uh, there is here, so I can have an easier time uh, sorting between three these three binary systems. Oh, 
another war low warning beacon in this system. Okay, awesome. I have explored this. Oh, and then a com relay. Nice. Let's go just capture that. Sure, fine. Engage, transfer command. Actually, I'm not totally certain I have the supplies I need to actually uh, survey all of these. Well, 120, that's a fair bit. How far am I from... Uh... Oh, I'm here. So, and they'll have just a bit more supplies for me. Hmm, yeah, no, I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna explore that. 
Just gonna explore the last planets here. Instead. Widespread ruins. Piscum was the one with the base, right? With the Ludic Path base. Yeah, this one was it. Yeah, they just uh, captured it, they didn't uh, destroy it to make something else. Uh, crap. Actually, they have a bigger fleet now. Thankfully, they're still not engaging, but still. Okay, just do a quick trade, get all the useful stuff here. What's the, dif uh, what's the difference between the, mm, you know, Wolverine and whatever Colossus and uh, uh, Pirate and sorry, the Ludic Path version? Oh, actually, I made I forgot about something, didn't I? Yeah, with the Eagle and the Onslaught, I was actually uh, going slower. I knew I forgot something. Let's remove harness subsystems, let's add augmented drive field. There we go. And the eagle, right? Where was it? There we go. That gets me back into the 8 speed base. Mm. 
Monkey okay, crew wise, I'm okay. I have around 200 more. Can I unmothball some ships? Okay, that is fine. Unmothball them, just repair them up. And actually, I think I'll take this opportunity and head back home. Uh, I've done quite a fair bit here. Might as well buy that for the Pokemon factor. And I should probably get out of here before these guys actually figure out if they all band together they can take me. Let's survey this because that was left to be surveyed and it's a habitable world. Well, it's habitable but far from useful. 125 uh, hazard rating. But yeah, that was right about it. Let's head back to Maeswa. I have a huge tail end of logistics and come uh, somewhat useless ships. But really, if we were to look at the actual uh, distribution of bounties, uh, there's a lot of activity here in the Regatta's Nebula and in even the Pis uh, Pisces. So. Basically what they did, uh, making a base here and uh, putting common networks all over so I have a constant supply of, you know, targets here, that was smart. I may just get back and do that because that's a decent way of actually farming some of the more special ships like, the, you know, battle group ships and stuff like that and monitors and stuff like that because these, gets, get, these get uh, spawned with different rules than the fleets in the core worlds for the factions. But yeah, for the moment, let's just head back home. Oh. It's a good thing I uh, went uh, went ahead and uh, upgraded the engines on those ships and then bought the Colossus Mark II which has a 6 speed. Smart. No, not at the sun. Oh, god damn it. Thankfully, it's a low corona star. I think there's a bounty for pirates my story, isn't there? Where is that bounty? Oh yeah, I'm on it. And yeah, system bounty my Asuga. Let's get to the Metropolis uh, and leave my stuff. First and foremost. Okay, right, so 
let's store this let's store this let's store this let's store this and this for the moment let's store this let's store this i'll bother with all of that later actually let's store this as well I don't know where to put that reckless officer in what. Oh, I actually stored the battle group. Yeah, I think I stored the battle group uh, Falcon. You know what? I'm gonna put it in the monitor. It's useless, but at the very least, you may learn some <laughs> patience. And actually, putting him in this, in a very strong and resilient ship, is maybe smart. You know, just get the ship in the enemy faces. And not really taking that much damage back. Let's drop all the cargo. Don't really want to get uh don't really want to get captured with uh AI cores. But where did I get 500 transport tonics? I mean, I didn't, I didn't have enough to do to create those uh, com relays, right? So where did I get 500 of them? Wait, am I retarded? No, I'm not. I'm not. I thought, I thought I, uh, I was l looking at the storage, you know, uh, here. But apparently, I wasn't. I just got some transportonics from somewhere, like a whole heap of them. Yeah, probably I got them in one of those uh, surveys, and I just skipped past it really, really fast. Probably even the last planet, the one next to the um, Pather base. Should pay some attention to those things.
Okay, I'm not even sure why I'm doing this. I have more than enough money. I don't need to chase so uh, three frigates and a destroyer across the map. Right. So, uh, goals. Right. I think it's about the point in the game where I should probably start setting some goals for myself. I think one uh, a good goal would probably be to uh, get back to those red beacon systems. I think I have two or three of them. Um, one, two. Hmm, thought there was more than two anyway. Either way, go back to those uh, medium and high systems and start uh, taking down the remnant uh, bases and actually remnants themselves. Uh, I'm probably gonna start with uh, the medium ones, just so I can get the feel for the combat as well as uh, what their uh, stations are capable of. And uh, then worry about the ones in the high. But yeah, that's probably gonna be my goal for the moment, uh, because at this point there, I see no real reason to continue farming bounties, I guess. I have enough money to go buying the ships I want, I may actually do a a bit of a solo play in between the, these episodes, this episode and the next one. So I will stock up on a beefier and proper coherent fleet. And then I'll actually go out and try my hand at the remnant in a serious capacity. <laughs> but anyway, uh, that's in the next episode. Uh, thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next one.